What's up everyone, so today I just want to test Basel. Um, yeah, again, I don't know how to pronounce his name, but yeah. So I uh, will look at this guy. I want to know uh, especially about his skill, uh, the summoning of the troop of Necromancer. So I will do some tests. I will take the bullet for you. If I did not find anything that say anything about that. So yeah, sorry if it's a little laggy as well. So I will try this one and I will just not win the fight so I will spend like 2 stamina. Okay so first thing I, I want to test is like right now what is the, the stat of the, the, the troop. So let's just go with a simple test. I just want to know like what is the stat right now if I summon one. Okay it's really more laggy than usual. So yeah. But yeah, whatever. If you look at his stat right now, it's the stat. So we just, um, yeah. I would just take these right now. So we have them to compare. There we go. So first thing first, I want to know uh, if I only boost the hero. Uh, will it change something and if I change the unit will it change something as well so let's start with boosting the hero so it should not be hard because my puzzle is not really tough he has some random equipment and there is some enchant but just for the, the quest the everyday quest alright so I will put all of them to maximum level should not be that hard all right. So this one first. All right, whatever. Okay. That will be the only change I do for um, I, like I could three star my stuff, but I did not gather the okay, so only one needed okay, no special because it's a silver one, but still it boosts my stat. Maybe I should have compared the whole stat with the new one of my hero to know like. Is there, is there like, a, is that linear to your power? Is that a percentage or is that like, I would think that there is a base value and that this base value is then boosted by a percentage of your hero stat. Okay, so let's start with that. So my stat has increased, but we don't really care about how, how much, unless you really want to know specific value but I, for me I personally just want to know like is that related to your proportional to your hero uh, stats all right yeah whatever chess yep okay so what is the stat now Uh, so you guys can see right now because of my face. I mean, you can you can still see uh, the right part. So it confirmed that the the hero stat don't change the the skeleton soldier stat. Or yeah, I mean, unless it was really a small change, but yeah, there is no more HP I'm seeing the right now under my head or oh, just move it so you can see there is no uh, the HP is the same alright so it's not about that okay unless it like I just said it changed but like a really small amount based on your stats but to me it looked like it is based on your 
uh, level I would think so if I go now if I just change the soldier so I will take the one this one has 163 attack I will go with the one with the most attack it will remove some of my power but if my attack increase will it change the attack I'm pretty sure then no if the level of the heroes, uh, the level, the stat of the heroes would change something, I would maybe think that okay, it can change uh, the stat, but I'm pretty sure that it will just do nothing. All right, let's see. So yeah, it changed nothing as well. It's the same about everything. The HP is the same. I can I confirm to you. <laughs> you have to believe me on this one. Still, like I said, it, it's hiding under my face. Um. Yeah. So the unit and the level, uh, the the stat changed nothing. Now the last test would be to to change the level. I would be surprised that this one don't change. If this one don't change, uh, it would be like really weird. <laughs> there has to be something that it's uh, based on, and I'm pretty sure it's the level. All right, so let's just put him uh, to level uh, like forty. I just get rid of the weaker one first. I prefer to do that. There is no specific reason. Oh, and I said you have to believe me on the last thing, but you are watching the video, so you, you can rewind if you want to see the whole HP. All right. So it should it should be the last one, and if you really want to know, but I would be really surprised again. I know I repeat the same stuff. My English is not that elaborate or whatever the the term I should use. But I could also look if I change class, if I upgrade class, like if it change something. But again, I would be really surprised. I really think it's only based on your level. Okay, so now, so as you can see, it changed right now. So the HP went to, uh, it was seven, 743, it's now one, 114. Uh, not that much of a change, but yeah. So attack is, attack has increased, de defense, skill, and defense, and intelligence. So everything has increased. It really looks like it's based on the um, the level yeah I won't be surprised again <laughs> okay I repeat I won't be surprised too much uh, yeah it showed the level so what I think is there is no equipment on this guy so it's really like oh it's level 40 these are the stats level 41 these are the stats so 95 100 okay uh, he, ha he has a skill that deals 1.3 damage of magic damage, so intelligence 145, 200, so it's not that far for the intelligence, and there is a, a boost right now because of his, uh, his passive that he uh, increased based on his magic defense. Replace in intelligence with 1.5 of his magic defense. So 1.5, it's uh, 66 more, so they they round up around the 200. Um, yeah, so the stat. But you have to keep in mind that my Bozel is Bozel <laughs> is not really good uh, on the equipment side. So it's kind of the similar stat of a unit that has no equipment, basically. It looked like a no equipment unit 
that you summon. So I'm pretty sure that late game the summon will be really uh, useless. But okay, let's just. Sh so the summon won't get strong that stronger, and the more the more you you will uh, get better stuff like six star equipment max level. I guess the gap will be huge unless they they really like scale the 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 unit stat but uh, like if you're level I don't know 60 that it it's like a unit that has four star max level equipment for example uh yeah so what I want to show you right now is just about the you can have more than one at once you can have as much as you want so if you have to fight in a fight that has like a lot of turn and you want to just be sure that to win for some reason and you need to summon two of them and to tank the tank the damage uh, a good thing about these is also that the since they are the weaker unit in your team if they are like behind but enough in, in the range of the enemy the enemy should go on them instead of your like healer or whatever it happened to me i i'm not saying that it will always happen but the hey high will most likely target these guy because they are weak so it can save you some of your healer sometime uh, if they die instead it's fine if they resist you can still heal them they are undead but you can heal with them so uh, i don't have any example but um, if I do heal we give the number okay it still show the number so even if they are they were max HP it show that they still get healed all right so that's pretty much it for me I don't have any other idea to test for this guy uh, and I did not build him uh, g good enough right now to give you an idea about like okay now it's freeze <laughs> really Oh, okay, my network. Uh, oh, okay, yeah, my internet just, just. Uh, all right, I'm pretty lucky that I'm not streaming right now. At least it's just a YouTube video. But yeah, thank you for watching and have a good one.